हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल हेलो गाइस टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ वी कैन कन्वर्ट स्पीच इनटू टेक्स्ट एंड टेक्स्ट इनटू स्पीच आई विल डिवाइड दिस वीडियो इन टू पार्ट्स इन फर्स्ट पार्ट आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू हाउ यू कैन कन्वर्ट योर स्पीच इनटू टेक्स्ट एंड इन सेकेंड वीडियो I will explain how you can convert your text into speech. For that, I am going to use a Kotlin programming language. I have designed already the layout. We have a two buttons. The first button will convert the speech, whatever I will speak out in microphone, that will be convert into text, and that text will be display in this edit text box. And in second video, whenever I will click on text to speech button it will read out all the text from this edit text button and you will listen the voice so this is the purpose of this application let we start so here i have already enabled the view binding in my application to remove the find by view id so here i have to call the button button speech that is my first button this one this button id that i will use this button to convert the speech into text so when whenever we click on this button we will convert the speech into text for that i need need a intent so intent here we are using recognizer intent dot action recognize speech that we are going to use and in this intent we have to set some parameter put extra so first parameter is recognizable intent dot extra language model that we have to put model also here recognition intent dot we have a model free form that we have to set second we have to set recognition intent dot extra language so language what we want we want the local language so we say local dot get default that would be the default language then what you want to say first time that we will add here that would be recognizable intent dot extra prompt so here we are saying something that uh, we say here that uh, recognizer intent extra prompt we are saying say something say something like this we say like this and here we have to start activity but start activity for result has been deprecated so we are using a new latest api that is using late binding late initialization of activity the result launcher that we are going to use here and here we are passing the intent in it now we will use it activity dot launch and here we will pass the intent to launch this and we have to put this one in try catch because if the hardware is not available then it will generate a error that your mobile is not capable to record your voice so here we have expression that is activity not found exception and here we can display toast also that is informing you that your device does not support so 
device does not support does not support it and we say duration of toast dot short length dot show like this now we have to get the result and display result into the edit text so for that activity launcher then register for start activity and here we say start activity for result like this and then we use this one and here we have to convert this into parameter lambda signature like this way and now I convert this name to result so we will use it now we have to check if result dot result of code equal to equal to result ok and the result dot data not equal to null if data is available then we have to display this data in the text view add text then that is text equal to that we have to read that data we are going to read here the data we are going to read that is where the we can say speech text equal to result dot data dot get string list extra and here we have to bind recognition dot extra result that we want and here we have to give not null and here we have to that speech should be converted into array list that would be of editable type like this and here we will pass the data that we have just speak and that would come in zero index so like this way this will be run and if I run this application then it will run in emulator so it is coming here whenever I will click on this you say it will display device does not supported because this emulator does not support the audio microphone so we are not able to speak out here but I will show you the demo of this application at the end of my second video that I will explain text to speech then in this video I will show you at the last to display the demo of this application using my physical mobile so for completely learning this application see my next video also text to speech so that's all in this video to understand it see you in next video to complete this video thank you for watching my video Thank you.